The famous town of Nkrofo, which is the district capital of the Elimbele district, the western region, and the birthplace of Ghana's first president, Dr. Kwame Nkrumah, is gradually becoming an Inogo area due to the deplorable state of the main road leading to the community. Recent rains have also worsened the situation with several vehicles stuck in the middle of the road, leaving pedestrians no other option than to trek to their various destinations. A report by William Benjamin Peters from the Western region. It is disappointing to note that a road leading to the birthplace of Osage for Dr. Kwame Nkrumah is in a bad state, but worse is what pedestrians and vehicles that ply the stretch go through. The situation has worsened following recent rainfalls. Potholes have now become manholes with several vehicles getting stuck in the middle of the road. The news team came across this unfortunate situation during a visit to Nkrofo when we had to spend close to an hour in traffic due to the situation. One articulator vehicle had to volunteer and tow some of the stuck vehicles to open up the congested road for the other road users. Unfortunately for the good Samaritan driver, his truck could not stand the slippery nature of the road and fell on its side. It took the effort of the stranded passengers to rescue the driver. Most of the passengers had to abandon their journey halfway, whilst others had to make it on foot to their various destinations. Most of the stranded passengers were simply not ready to speak to us due to their anger. Thankfully, the Joy News brand worked some magic for us, as the stranded passengers helped us to make our way through the other end of the road to enable us to continue our journey. In a related development, the Member of Parliament for Alembela, who doubles as the Minister for Energy and Petroleum, Emmanuel Amako Fibua, has disclosed that plans are far advanced to construct the road at a cost of over 10 million Ghana cities. I told the DC so many times. Every time I get to a CM and a branch and I'm coming to Ngrofro to Telekubu Castle, I get depressed. And I put my head down like this. I am very happy to finally, and I can say this in public, because I stood there when the Minister of Finance signed that certificate of commencement, that finally the road from Eziama to Telekubokazo through Krofo will be completely asphalted and done first class.